morning everybody. So I'm getting ready to go to work today and I'm going to bring you guys along my day in the life of course and um, today I get my second coat shot um, so I'm a little nervous. My brother who usually doesn't feel anything during like um, his shots this is so not cute. Doesn't typically feel like any symptoms afterwards. I always do, but um, he felt like a little like under the weather just a little bit. So I have my Tylenol. Uh, I'm drinking plenty of fluids. Uh, set you guys up for a second on here so I can drive. I have my makeshift tripod. I am on my way to paradise. Way to hell. Anyway, so yeah, so got my Tylenol, got my little snack I'm gonna eat this morning, and we should be good to go. Also, I need to find a freaking engagement photo outfit. I I have ordered like millions of things and had to send them back because I did not like it. It didn't it didn't fit with what it, my vibe like I was going for. So I'm gonna go to Marshalls today after work, um, and hopefully I can find something because we take our engagement photos this weekend. I have nothing to wear like literally nothing so also I have to return that Lulu's package because I had ordered like this dress and it just wasn't it wasn't doing it for me so yeah lots to do today lots to get done but first deal of business is this coca shop So I think I left off where I was taking the COVID shot. I was going into work. And let me tell you guys something. That COVID shot, the second dose, is no joke. I have been out for the last two days. Um, I actually ended up going to work the next day because someone's um, had a family emergency. So I was like, freak, I have to go and go into work. But I started feeling horrible that day that I got the shot. And I was out the whole day. I took some Tylenol and I was out. And then the next day was like, that, that night and the next day, complete torture but I'm good it was only like maybe 12 hours I felt really bad um so those are two too bad no one told me I mean my brother did mention um that like he wasn't feeling well I think I did say that in the vlog um but uh that he didn't feel well and he he said that but I just like I wasn't sure if that was just him or anyone but Amanda said the same thing pretty sure saw you no one said the second one is gnarly for everybody but just be warned, the second shot, yeah. It was worse than actually getting COVID, like, it was. So, it is Saturday, and Penny Bear is working on his car with his brother somewhere. Well, not somewhere, I know where he's at. Um, I think I burned that a little too much. But I'm making chicken stew, it's almost done. I'm waiting for the eggs, the boiled eggs to, um, Cool down so I can peel them and then I kind of burned it a little bit but this is some okra since Kenny Bear doesn't really like okra I just pan fried it but it's really good with the char on it so it's not that bad so made that and I've got some rice oh also I gotta put this in the chicken stew I like to <coughs> oh my god I like to um personally when I make sausages or this is how my mother-in-law my sister-in-law taught me um they like to brown their stuff but I personally like to brown my ch uh, sausage before I pour it into something because all the fat and stuff, you can get most of the fat out if you pan fry it first. Um, and then I like to let it drain before I put it in my chicken stew because nobody wants oily chicken stew. So this is my second time making it and I think this time it's good. The first time it was good, but this one I, I have a good feeling about. Like it looks, as you know, looks much better. Louisiana housewife anyway so that's done where is the lid I mean I busted out my new pots that I bought when I was when we were in Louisiana last we bought some new pots and then I'm gonna give my little brother um, the old ones that I had so that is all that's going on for today good also if anyone needs some freaking um you know to go plates hit me up because this man brought all of this. I am glad he brought some Tupperware because I don't know if it's just my house, but Tupperware just disappears really quickly, so. 
Got a whole thing of Tupperware. I busted out the new um, cooking, cookware, pots and pans that we bought and I love them so far. Um, so actually spent a little bit more money on these than I did the first ones. So you know people be broke when they first get their first apartments. So yeah, I'm gonna let these eggs cool down a little bit and peel them and then throw them in the stew. And I'll let you guys know how it tastes. Actually, I'll get a reaction to what Kenny says. All right, so everything is done. Just let this cool down. I added the um, sausages and I also have to boil the egg as well. I think I put like seven eggs. We like the eggs, boiled eggs. And I finished the okra. Pretty good. And then on the rice is done. I just like to let my rice, the steam, come off a little bit because I don't like it to be like really, I don't know, like wet. <laughs> so I let the steam fluff it up a little bit and let the steam come out and it will be perfect. So I'm going to enjoy this awesome meal and, oh, Dan get some, he'll get some later. <laughs> Cause I am so hungry. I haven't ate all day hardly. I think we ate, no, we had breakfast this morning, but I didn't eat. So I'm gonna enjoy this. Several days later. saw um so kenny got another car kind of not like what you think we didn't buy it um he traded in like an old one of his old cars that he's had for years and years and years like years his um camaro and he traded it in for his truck so we've been looking for a truck and he's gonna have to uh, find other options for his camaro so yeah that's what we we're doing we we're just cleaning it out because it was super dirty and like had sand and dirt in it so that's what we were doing if you're wondering hi guys this vlog is so all over the place but um it's been a crazy few days <laughs> so i'm kind of like catching up on vlogging and stuff um i was like like i said i was out down for the count when i got a little under the weather from getting the shot oh. um so i'm catching up on vlogs just fyi I'm trying to clean up a little bit get a house in order this will never happen. I mean, this is like my little lounge. Turn that over. This is like my little lounge area, like where I edit and everything. So it's always kind of like this anyway. Nobody goes in there except me. Um, so, yeah. One other thing I'm trying to figure out how to do. I told you guys earlier in this vlog that Kenny Bear. Also, need to throw this away. I have so many little things that I've got to get done. That's what I'm working out of right now. Kenny Bear came home with all these to go plates um and i think i'm just gonna store them in the guest room closet because we did take his toolbox out of them so yeah yeah this guy i do appreciate him he does bring home goodies and it's nice but sometimes i'm like why but i remember growing up my dad used to do that all the time so i think it's a guy thing um and then he came he brought some tupperware and then like this I did need I did need some more Tupperware. Sorry, it's dark over here. And then something with this. I don't know what this is. I'll come back and. Boom. All kinds of random things in here. I do not wanna. My camera's dying. Of course it is. Of course it is. Um, they have this quilt thing. This is for a king size, though. These are 
pillowcases, fitted sheets. It's cool. So, I don't even know where he got this from. I think in the same place he got all the other stuff. So, oh, my battery's dying, guys. So, this will probably towards the be towards the end of the vlog. My kitchen's gonna look so much better now. I'm glad, because I had to get that out of there. It's going crazy with that stuff sitting there. Then I'll go through this Tupperware later. Sit that there. And then this little bag I'll put back there and we'll be good.